Welcome to today's video. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to make a bunny envelope. So the materials we require are some colored paper, a pair of scissors, a pencil, and some glue. Let's start off by choosing one of the brightest colors I have. You can choose a color of your choice. Let's first flip the paper and fold it into half. and make a crease. Now open it up. Turn the paper and again fold it into half making a vertical and a horizontal crease. Now open this up. Now make this end of the square meet this end. Pick the end up and place it on the other end. Let's make a fine crease. Now open this up. Turn the paper and let's make this end meet this end of the square. And let's make a crease. Open this up now. Let's turn the paper a little. Pick this end and Fold it towards the center of the square. Let's make a crease. Open this up too. Let's take this part of the paper and fold it towards the center of this line. And let's make a crease. Open this up. Same, pick the same end and fold it towards the center and make a crease. Open this up. Now, let's mark this point and this point. These two points are the centers of this line and this line respectively. Name this A and name this B. Let's pick up the side that is closer to B and fold it halfway through the center of the square and make a crease. Open this up. Do the same on the other side. Let's just make a crease. Open this up too. Now we have to cut along these lines. So let's take our scissors. But then be careful when you're using them because they're pretty sharp. And this is just halfway through. You don't have to cut the whole crease. Let's do the same on side A2. And let's cut this halfway through. And now we're going to fold this inwards along this particular crease. Okay? And then we're going to take this part of the paper and fold it in words too. And we're going to press this down. That is, the paper that is looking like this is going to be folded in words and placed down. Let's pick the paper at point B and push it to point A. Fold this piece of the paper inwards and then we'll fold it outwards now pick these two points from a and put them to b pick this paper and fold it backwards just to make a stronger crease open this up now Pick the point A and fold it inwards. Pick the paper at point B and fold this inwards. And let's open it up. Now about half a centimeter, pick this point and fold it inwards. Now just take this paper and fold this downwards and make a strong crease. 
Let's fold this part of it backwards. Let's fold this part inwards and then backwards so the crease is stronger. And let's just place this down. Take this triangle and this triangle and fold it inwards. So pick these points and fold it inwards. Do the same on the other side. Now let's pick this paper and fold it by covering half of the bunny's ears. Oh wait, I forgot to tell you. These are going to be our bunny's ears. So let's cover one of the ear and make a crease. Do the same on the other side. Let's make a crease again by covering both the bunny's ears. Now pull the bunny's ears from beneath the paper and place them above. Pick the paper up and fold this backwards. Open this up. There is a crease. Now fold this paper inwards along with the crease. Open this up. There's a second crease over here. Fold this inwards. And here, this is the place we're going to use our glue stick to gum the bunny down. Okay? Yes. There you go. So the bunny is nicely stuck. Just press it once. And then there is this pocket that is created. Let's pick this corner and place it inwards. And now the last part where the bunny's ears are going to open up. Fold it this way and fold the other ear the other way. And open this up and press it down so the ears look opened up now open this up and press this ear down too so the bunny's ears are opened up and this is the bunny envelope is definitely one of the best ways to write a lovely message for your loved ones you can also get creative by adding a few gems or you could draw small eyes and a mouth for it. You could add more gems like I've done here. You could use varying colors. You can use larger size papers for a bigger envelope. I'll be posting once every week. For more art videos, stay tuned to my channel. Do subscribe, like, share and comment.